Welcome to the training video for positioning the TMS coil. In this video, we'll cover finding the motor cortex, the medial prefrontal cortex, and the dorsolateral prefrontal cortex. For each of these regions, you'll need to place a swim cap on the participant's head. Make markings on both sides of the ear, down the center of the head, and on both sides of the opposite ear. You'll measure from the nasian to the inion and mark on each side of the ruler. You'll then measure from the right tragus to the left tragus and mark on each side of the ruler. This will allow you to find the apex of the head. You'll also measure the circumference of the head and you'll need all three of these measurements to find each location. Don't forget to mark from the nasian to the rim of the cap so we can place it in the same location. For finding the motor cortex, there's a great resource, clinicalresearcher.org slash EEG. You begin by inputting the three measurements you have just taken on the scalp. Click Submit and Locate, and based on those measurements, you can start at the apex of the head and find the motor cortex. The 6 centimeters is measured from the apex down to the left tragus. Create a mark at the 6 centimeters, and this is where you will place the coil. We place electrodes under the cap, two centimeters apart, and place the coil on top. We also add foam padding in between the coil and the scalp for comfort. To find the medial prefrontal cortex, most commonly used in addiction studies, we can also use clinicalresearch.org EEG. Again, you'll begin by entering the three measurements you have just taken on the scalp. Click Submit and Locate, and starting at the apex of the head, you can move up to the FP1, which is your medial prefrontal cortex. Again, we place electrodes on the head, two centimeters apart, underneath the swim cap. Place them on each side of the dot that we have created for the most stimulation. We use the arm to adjust and position the coil and make sure that the coil is flat on the participant's head. We add foam padding in between the coil and the scalp to aid in comfort. To find the dorsal lateral prefrontal cortex, most commonly stimulated for depression, we can use clinicalresearcher.org, but instead of slash EEG, it's slash F3. In this program, you'll also begin by entering the three measurements that you've just taken on the scalp and click Calculate. The output is the three distances that you must measure to find the DLPFC. This program gives a great visual representation of how to measure on the scalp. Once you've done your measurements and created your mark, we have placed electrodes on each side of the dot two centimeters apart. Move the coil from the motor cortex up to the dot that you have created. Keep the coil at the 45 degree angle. We then place foam for comfort. And that concludes the training video for positioning the coil. Thanks for watching.